And oh. So first of all, GFTC bot is linked to a website. Um, if you haven't used it, you should. That's where you have your keep upgrade calculator. Someone said they needed to um, print troops. They also have that. So if you go here, you can type in what like tier you're trying to make. Say you're trying to print T7. Um, total troops to train if you wanted to make like 100,000 of those. Um, and then max troops per round goes off of how many troops you print per one click of the gold. So like me, maybe 1,500. I think I'm at like 1,800. And then training speed, you just look at your... Um, your buff, your buffs or your boost in your um, your character profile. Then you go to like stats. Say you get two hundred percent, which wouldn't be bad. Because with decent gear, you should get about one hundred fifty. And then with an SFP, three hundred. And then it's gonna just tell you what you need exactly. So you're gonna need one hundred one hundred thousand gold, sixty six point seven times. This is how much gold it would cost to print one batch of fifteen hundred, um, and then each material. So that's how you would kind of calculate that. Um, now, if you're doing a build calculator, you're going to want to go off of uh, the bot on Discord better. So you would type it. Help. Help. So this is kind of a list of what you can do, okay? And when you do this bot, it actually will send you a DM. So you would do GT um, build list, and get, that gives you the list of buildings that you're going to want to put in the into the bot. Um, so estimation with GT slash build list. Here, here. Bang. It just sent me this. So it kind of just gave me a list of, of what you need to upgrade. Okay. So start, you would do it as GT build. And then you would do um, it's update. And then you would type in each building. So same 26. And now it's going to upgrade in the system that I just have a keep 26. Okay. So you get all your buildings, and I'll pull mine so I don't have to type it all in, but and then I'll just edit it. Um, but you want to use this to get an exact amount of keystone you need, most importantly, along with uh, everything else, um, especially keystone. Because you know, if, if you're going for keystone, you're buying packs. You want to know how many packs you're buying without overbuying. More packs than I need for the upgrade, and I don't know why I don't have a full list, but. Anyway, that's okay, we'll do it. We'll do it manually. So what you do is you just copy this. Okay, so you're gonna copy that. Um, paste it here. And then you're gonna go to the top. Type, GT, build, update. And then you wanna do these. So you're going to go through and type in all your building numbers. Um, 26 for Jamal Keep, Wall, 26, Smithy, Base Man, are you sure I don't have it up there? Whatever. Um, I'll just find one that I did in here. So this is the last update I did. Um, so you would type in your update and then you would put each building. First, that's the initial, but for now I'm putting just what I have. Um, and it's saying it upgraded, updated my, my info. If you type in um, my info, I could have just got it there, but also you could type in your speed. So that'll give you your, your construction speed because sometimes people want to speed boost um, their builds by using gold, which I 500,000% don't do, and I would never do it. I think it's a terrible idea. The only thing you should ever spend gold on in this game is stamina um, for, for farming, and maybe templates for gear are like the two main things. If not, plus, you get a house level. So don't ever spend. I mean, if I'm 500 short, sometimes I mean, you're sitting on a fat stack, but um, generally, I wouldn't. I wouldn't do it. So now. You're gonna to want to type in um, sorry. Okay, well. type in this once you have it all in. Now it gave me everything. Um, I'm pretty sure I'm way higher than that, but whatever. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna copy um, this for video's sake. 
And then as you upgrade each building, you want to come in and just re-update your info so that um, you know how much you need still. I mean, I usually just get how much I need, and then I'll go out and get it all, and then I'll upgrade all at once during an event like tonight I'm going to. But um, if you're keep 17 or 18 and you're just pushing for 19 or 22, then you should update each building so that you can see if anything's changed. Um, because if your speed's changed or whatever and you're using gold for speed ups rather than using speed ups, it might do that. So anyway, I upgraded all of that. Now, the next thing you want to do to get to know how much you want for things is you type in GT build cost. What this is going to do is say, hey, can you tell me how much it's going to cost for me to get to whatever I type in? So on a normal day, you would type like I would type K, uh, K27, you would type keep 27. This is just going to tell me how much it costs for keep 27. So what it gives you is how much gold it costs in total. That means if you were to spend gold on everything. So that's going to give you it. So I need 326 million food, wood, 24 million stone, 7 million iron, 3,500 keystone, 10,000 pine, and 28,000 brick. But you can also do more than one thing. So for me, I always do um, I always do my keep, my next keep I need. But I also do the training yard because that gives me more march, uh, uh, march size. And then I also do maester tower to, so I can do more research. Um, because, you know, research actually caps us at each level. So I would type in that. And then it's going to give me a list of what I need in total for all of those things. And then on the bottom of this, it just tells you what you need to upgrade. So this one wasn't a good example because it's just saying, hey, you need to upgrade just your keep. But this one, it's telling me, look, you need your keep upgraded, your training yard, your mace tower, and your medic tent. Um, if I was going for, say, keep 28, it's going to give me a whole list of what I need with dashes, which is what you want to see because that's what you will see. So now it's saying you need your keep to 27 and 28, your wall to 27, you need your rookery um, 24 to 27. So you start at 24 and you're going to get to 27 and then stop. And then at all these end levels, that's your goal. Okay, so always go, um, always go with, um, if you're trying to print troops, so right now you're, say you're, say, well, I can't use me, but say you're you and you're uh, keep 18, but you really want keep 19 for t7 you have to remember that just because you get to a keep 19 doesn't mean you can print tier 7 troops you actually need to either get one of those troop buildings to the same level so if your levels were like keep were if you know if 27 was to build t8 say instead of 22 or whatever you would um and i wanted calves i would put it like that which i could still do and it's going to tell me what i need to build both so it's saying, okay, you want to get your keep to 27 and your stable to 27, then you're going to need to do all these things. So you're, if you're going for certain troop level, not your keep level, then always add, you know, whatever you need. And it's going, like, whatever building type you need. Um, and it's going to tell you what you need in total, even if it costs other buildings need to be upgraded first. Because, like, a maester tower um, is an upgrade for your shrine. So if I were to do it like this... Say I wanted to get my shrine up for some reason. I had an inkling. Um, I would put um, shrine 27. It's going to tell me that I need to build my keep 27, my maester 27, and then I can do my shrine. And your medic 10, obviously, you need two. So, see, those are those steps. So, keep 27 would be my first 27 I got. Then a medic 10 is second. And then you do your maesters is third, and your shrine is fourth. Because it requires a maester for shrine, and it requires a medic 10 for maester. So it's going to tell you every building, not just, you know, the buildings you want to upgrade. And it'll give you your total cost. So I would be like, okay, I need 7,000 keystone for this. So once I get 7,000 keystone and my, my brick and pine are farmed, um, and I got all my materials ready, I can get my hammer out and go smash the dirt.